Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more La Mulana 2. Uh, in the last episode, I left off with no leads, but uh, I'm about to pick up with one because Atum here is a creation deity who was self begotten from primeval waters before creating other gods in turn. So, whenever we are running, running into a creation myth, we use the egg of creation, and that makes something happen while also killing us. Uh, yeah. Good times! Uh, I'll get back to you guys on what exactly that does later. I have returned. There is a secret wall. There is a uh, fake wall here. Nigoro! Uh, not entirely sure what this does. Hmm. Well, if we uh, if we turn off our software and load up a bunch of games. We get nothing. Alright, I have no idea what this room is then. <laughs> hey, I am back. Uh, I just talked to a, an NPC in this room, the Room of the Sun. It was Ra Harakti, and uh, he just went off in this direction. He's... He's going into that gate. Alright, let's follow him. We may have just stumbled upon something huge, I don't know. Let's take a look. Ow. Okay, let's follow this raw character, which, uh, by the way, I also just got uh, some data on him. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Let's see if we can't track him down. go down here by any chance? No. There were a couple of empty rooms I, uh, I want to check out again now that uh, uh, we have uncovered a bird man. There was one in this room before, he's not here now. set have to say about all this. Yeah, he doesn't have anything to say. Let's see, uh, what was this area about? What was this about? Uh, oh, Fairy Guild Lieutenant. 
Right, still don't know how to get into the fairy guild. with our ultimate weapon, Aten, should be possible. There's the Ankh! Alright, let's go fight Ra. As soon as I uh, have a drink. Hundred seventy six health. Got an Ankh jewel. We might just be ready to go. At least I hope we're ready to go. Is uh, quite the weapon you got there, buddy. Oops. What if I fire some flares at him? That does nothing. Ooh! Hello. Okay, I hit him three times, that did a thing. Get out of the way before he falls on me. Crunch. I think we may have something going here, guys. known to me. Alright, one more phase. Summoning trick is getting a little old there, Ra. Just want to tell you that. Okay, get out of the way. Alright, this should do it. No, okay. are getting very spammy. Not sure how I feel about that. Ooh! <laughs> I got crunched. Oh well. I know what I'm doing, so let's do it. Pick your killer axe and kill. If only I had the axe. <laughs> okay, stay out of the way here. And wait for him to make a move. It's a little hard to keep him from summoning things, honestly, but... I mean, that's what happens when you're huge, I guess. Okay, first cycle down. Very slightly, I'm 
going fast and I may not be able to keep up with his nonsense. Like, uh, like so. That's fine, though. One more try, and then I will leave and come back with more HP. He kind of looks like he's wearing the uh, scary, shiny glasses. Which makes him actually a lot less threatening looking. <laughs> Bird with glasses. I really should be using my shield. It saved me a lot of trouble. Third. Down he goes. Haha, uh -huh. your ancient Egyptian laser beams are no match for my shield. I do wish you would stop summoning every anything and everything, though. Okay, he's gonna fall. Okay, a couple more hits ought to do it. Gotcha! That was a uh, remarkably easy for the fourth boss. Maybe I just have too much health. Congratulations, you have obliterated Aten Ra! But the adventure continues. Lumisa, the God Slayer. Insane Sun is the achievement I got. Crucifix. Ooh. And some new dissonance for the Beherit. What's this do for me? A ritual item that guards against attacks from vengeful spirits. Grants invulnerability to ghost-type enemies. Well, that's nice. It's uh, not quite the amount of progress I was hoping for. But it's nice. I wonder what Set has to say now that I've uh, killed Ra. Idiot. <laughs> well, somebody's an angry dog. Uh, this doesn't help me at all, though. Hmm. 
Like, I didn't exactly accomplish anything by doing this, is my problem here. You need five guardians to open the next uh, gate I see, I saw. And Jormungand is still playing hard to get with his, uh, his key. out of curiosity. No? Nothing? Alright. Ben Ben Stone. Small stone shrine made to resemble the primeval mound. We did hear something about that, but I forget what. Well, I may have to end things off for uh, this episode. We did do a thing, which uh, I am pretty happy with. But uh, it doesn't seem to have gotten us anywhere. So uh, I'll see you in episode 45 when we uh, try and make some real progress. Bye bye for now. Something that comes to mind when, uh, after we've killed Ra, uh, since we have his dissonance and we have killed the boss, what happens if we go back in the Corridor of Blood? The place gets splattered with blood. Cool beans. So, if I had to guess, there are, uh, there's like three more bosses that we have to kill to get something to happen in the Corridor of Blood. Uh, that is all for this report. Bye-bye.